Hi, I'm Jas Mortier. I already did a video um, about Ampex style uh, base cabinet, uh, one with uh, thick mineral wall as isolation and one uh, just total empty. Uh, and to my surprise, the differences were pretty subtle. Uh, one of the bigger differences was a slightly drop in volume with the mineral wool. It's pretty dense and pretty thick, so I guess it just takes away a lot of volume of the cabinet. So I decided to look for isolation material that was a bit thinner. Uh, I was uh, reluctant to uh, use the what they I think I what they used was the glass wool and it was thinner, it's like an inch thick. Uh, First of all, I couldn't find it at all, but I'm also a bit reluctant because of the vessels, the glass wool vessels. So I was really happy to find this sheep wool. It's not as dense as a woolen blanket and it's used for isolation of uh, floors. And it's mega easy to work with. You just easily can staple it to the walls of your cabinet. This time I mic'd the whole cabinet, not just close mic one speaker. I mic'd it at about two feet distance, uh, that's 60 centimeters or something. Um, so hopefully you can get an idea of how the cabinet would sound live. So let's hear the samples. So once again, the differences are really subtle. I measured the volume difference and the sheep wool is like half a dB louder. I don't think you hear that live, but it's a plus for the sheep wool. Um, maybe the middle wool is slightly bit more focused, maybe a bit drier, but live I didn't notice. I did a couple of gigs with the sheep wool version and I was totally happy. Uh, I decided to also uh, cover the side walls this time. So now the side walls, the top, the bottom and the back are covered with uh, isolation. Okay, that's it. Thank you. Bye.